Hi, chefs. Hello. Good morning. Hello. We'll do some introductions here in just a second. Yes. We're talking about Thanksgiving meal side dishes. We love to do this every year. Because mm -hmm. you have to have some green on your plate. You well, there should be this, you know. some green. I, I have a tendency to ignore it. But the, this is so good, what you guys have created, mm -hmm. that uh, I'm, I'm going to eat some greens. Nice. Okay. <laughs> What's your name, sir? Up. I'm Jack. Hi, Jack Peterson. Jack from? Walnut Street Cafe. Which is a great place. Mm -hmm. uh, it's over on Walnut Street, as a matter of fact. Is it? Yeah. Imagine that. It's over there. In, what is that, University City? Yeah, it's University City. All right. But there's a difference because some people, they may love their, oh, that's beautiful. Yes, there it is. Um, some people, they love green beans, but when it comes to green bean casserole, there might be a little different situation. You yeah. Know? They're usually overcooked, but if you do it right. Yes. Okay. It's really good. So what do you have here? So then? right here is like a traditional green bean casserole. Instead of cream mushroom soup, I made a mushroom cream with cream, uh, maitake mushrooms. And there's some crispy shallots on top of there. So that's our traditional one. Mm -hmm. Right. And then I have a little bit of different one over here. These are sauteed green beans. And it's got a miso Caesar vinaigrette on oh. there. And then I have some truffle panko oh. bread curls. See, this looks like you took it up a bunch of notches from yeah. Just that. a couple, yeah. It's all shiny and stuff. Yeah, why, is it, why are your beans so shiny? <laughs> I'm trying to get... Now, a bean should have a snap to it, right? It should. It should be a little crunchy, yeah. My mm. God, that's mm -hmm. really good. That's amazing. You know what you're doing. Sometimes. <laughs> are you guys going to be open for Thanksgiving? We are open for Thanksgiving um, from 12 to 6, and we have a okay. special Thanksgiving menu. I've got a bunch of turkeys ready to cook, so. Very nice. We're really looking forward to it. And what's the key that. to keeping it crunchy? Because you want it to be close, so you want it to have the. A... I blanch them in boiling water, and then right when they're cooked, get them in ice water. Ah. And so then I just heated them up again in the pan. Okay. I mean, listen to that crunch. Yeah. That's really good. Awesome. All right, you know what you're doing. Yeah. And it's so funny, when it comes to the other green we're going to talk about, Brussels sprouts. When I was a kid, I did not like them at all. Nope. Now, I love them, especially if they're done right. The dreaded Brussels sprouts. The dreaded Brussels sprouts. Good morning. I like right. them yeah. rare and naked. Myself. Rare and naked. Well, we have got, I mean, when you have good sprouts and good products, I'm, two ways. They're beautiful, just very sim simply cooked. Right. These, uh, I like to blanch, just the same as Jack. You know, I like to blanch in boiling solid water. What does blanching mean? Blanching is submersing them into boiling solid water for a short amount of time. That shocks the color, keeps the color inside. Then you take them out, put them in iced water, cold water. Cold so that's water. the key for the segment yeah. today, is everybody's cold doing water. that. By <laughs> the way, I should say cold water, shouldn't I? No? <laughs> yeah. 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 I want to remind water. everyone, right. of course, okay. you're with the Bruno Brothers. That's right, mm -hmm. yeah. See, um, so how do you do yours? So you then, the then I love to put, you know, we have this lovely, this is my favorite olive oil. De Bruno Brothers Sicilian olive oil. Drizzle it over. Okay, let's hold it up so we can... Salt and pepper. Roast them in the oven mm. for like 12 to 15 minutes, around 300. That's simple. Very simple. Mm -hmm. But then to give it another touch, what, and this is how we're going to be selling them. Um, we have a beautiful catering package from our De Bruyne Brothers Catering in events. Mm. What did you just put on there? Some extra That's... Sicilian olive oil. Wow. Here we have some lovely aged balsamic. The Ooh, De Bruyne see, Brothers I love that. aged balsamic. So that's how we're selling it in our catering and events. Okay. Um, equally, we very often do it with these beautiful nuts. These are the Tres Toffee um, Pecans. Very on season, oh. you know, pecans, oh, caramelized pecans. Oh, I've never um, seen you can that. buy these in the store, very easy. Mm -hmm. um, you buy them, you crumble them up, and that sort of gives you an added crunch. crunch. Are you guys open uh, Thanksgiving morning? We are. Wow. So all of our stores are open Thanksgiving day. day. Um, mm -hmm. You know, we, we close early. Uh, packages yeah. are available for our catering department. Very nice. But hurry up because we're pretty, uh, we're pretty much sold out. Oh of my our gosh! Catering. Hurry and get so it. we're taking a few more orders this week, mm. and all of our Thanksgiving um, food arrives in our stores this coming Wednesday. All right. uh, special offer: a dollar off all sides. Oh, very so nice. That's a great, Fantastic. great bargain. Yeah. Chefs, thank, thank you. you. Thank